In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to open a new window in Google Chrome. When you're in Google Chrome, you'll normally have this one window with all your tabs in it like this, and it's its own individual window like that that you can drag around and close and open and everything. But it doesn't necessarily have to be just one window. You could actually open as many windows as you like. All you need to do is click on the three dots in the top right hand corner up here. So click on those three dots there. And then in this menu that appears, come down here and click new window. And now you have a new Chrome window with a new tab in it. So now you have your original window with all of your existing tabs in it. And you have this new window with a new tab in it. And if you wanted to, you could start opening multiple tabs in here and going to multiple different websites in this new window. And you can do whatever you want with it. It's just another window of Chrome. Or alternatively, there's also a slightly faster way to open a new window in Chrome by using a keyboard shortcut. All you need to do is hold down the control key on a Windows computer or a Chromebook or hold down the command key on a Apple Mac and then press the letter N and a new window will immediately open. So just by pressing those two keys on your keyboard, you've opened a new window. It is only slightly faster than clicking on the menu and clicking new window. So it's really up to you which one you use. But if you like keyboard shortcuts and you can remember this shortcut, it can be a very helpful shortcut because you can just open a new window that quickly. Or the third and final method to open a new window is by clicking and dragging one of your existing tabs out of the existing window. So the other two methods just opened up a new blank tab in a new window. But with this third method, we can actually move one of your existing tabs out into its own new window. So we'll close these two windows that we opened. So now we just have this original window again. And let's say we want to move this tab out into its own new window and leave all of these tabs in the original window. All you need to do is click and hold on the tab. And then while you're still holding the click button, drag down like that until it pops out into its own new window. So now, this tab is its own window, so it has its own new window in here, and you can open additional tabs in here if you want. It's just a normal window that's being opened for this tab, and all of the old tabs are still in that window. And you can also move tabs in between windows if you want to. So maybe if you had this tab that's also in the original window, and you wanted to also bring this tab out, and put it in this window, all you would need to do is click and drag it out of its original window like that, and then drag it over to the other window and drop it inside there. So you just sort of position it as though it's a tab in there and then let go. And now it will become a tab in that window. So we might close this new tab in here and we just have these two tabs that we moved from the original window to the new window. But it can get a bit difficult to move a tab from one window to another when the two windows are overlapping each other like this. Because if we wanted to move this tab from its existing window into this window, when we click on it to try and drag it, the original window will now cover the new window. So we can drag it out like this, but you can't get into the old with the new window that you want to drag it into. So you want to make sure you have them not entirely overlapping. So we have this one right over here and we have this one right over here. So now there's this space in the new window we can still see. So we can drag it in like that and drop it in there. So you do have to be a bit strategic. You probably want to shrink your Chrome windows down a bit 
by clicking and dragging in the corner like that. So if you have them both shrunken down, they'll take up less space on the screen and it's easier to not have them overlapping as much. So you can drag tabs in between windows like that. But once you get the hang of it, and once you get used to dragging tabs from one window to another, it can be very handy to just be able to move the tab rather than having to close it in that window and then open the tab in another window and go to the same website. This is a lot faster. So that's really cool. And that's all there is to opening new windows in Chrome. And when you're done with a Chrome window and you want to close it, all you need to do is click the cross in the top right hand corner of the window on a Windows computer or a Chromebook or on a Mac computer, click on the red dot in the top left corner. It's basically the same button, just a different position. So you'll click that button, whatever it is, and the window will be closed. So for as many windows as you want to close, whenever you want to close them, just click on that button on that window and it will be closed. And you'll just be left with the window that you didn't close. And that's all there is to it. That's how you can create new windows in Chrome. So hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you wanna learn how to open an incognito window in Chrome, or how to open a guest mode window in Chrome, Timmy has videos on how to do both of those things right here.